Hello everyone, welcome back to Withdraw Tips and in this video we are going to talk about how to fix Payday 3 is having Audio or sound is not working, it is crackling, distorted, popping or audio issue which is happening for many of the users right now and how we can fix this up So let's dive into the workaround The first one is all about when you are having this trouble We need to run the game as an administrator For this we just need to go over here in the game Right click and we have to go to the properties Go to the install it file and just click on the browse so when you go back you will be taken to this particular folder this is where the game is installed now go to the payday 3 and go to the content uh, sorry just go back go to the binaries win64 this is the application right click go to the show more option go to properties compatibility click on run this program as an administrator go for apply go for ok and close this and we have to go back try launching the game next one is all about what we need to do is after trying with the first step if it's not working we have to move to the next one that is all about we need to install the graphics card we need to update the graphics card manually so i'll be providing a link in the description to both nvidia as well as to the amd so uh, the nvidia users has to go to this page and from here here we have to select all the details like a product type product series product operating system everything should be selected so you can see the product type is Geoforce and the product series is Geoforce RTX Product should be selected And the operating system is Windows 11 And you can select every details over here and go for start search Now if you scroll down, you will be taken to this page And this is the driver version 5.37.34 And the released version is uh, September 12, 2023 So you can download this one, install, restart is a mandatory And try launching the game so if you're on the AMD, just go over here in this particular one, select every details over here and go for submit. Now from here, as you can see, if you go for the Windows 11, download this one. If you're on Windows 10, we can download this one and install. Restart is a mandatory and try launching the game. Next one is all about nothing but what we need to do is we just need to move to the next step. That is all about we have to try restarting the game as well as the Steam. So just uh, close the game and also uh, closing the steam is not actually a restart just go over here at the top go for exit the steam try steam once again and give the uh, details it will take a little bit of time to log in back once after this try launch the game and that will be working fine as well next one we have to check the volume mixer so just go over here as you can see go to the speaker icon make sure this is not muted if this is muted you try launch the game and try to play you'll not be hearing any voices so just uh, make sure this is 100 percentage and launch the game so this by default by mistakenly we used to do this up so just do this and also we have to go over here in the settings go to the sound over here and make sure the speaker over here in the output and the speaker is selected you have selected the right audio device so for the microphone it is realtek r audio and the speakers is as you can see it is also realtek r audio so we have to cross check both the thing are working fine now once afterwards just close this and we have to go back try launching the game next one is all about nothing but what we need to do is we just need to set the sam uh, sound sample rate to uh, 44 or 48 so just go over here in the search we have to go for the control panel now go for uh, hardware and sound go for the sound over here now go to the speakers right click and we have to go to the properties now from here go to the advanced set this up so you can set this to 24 bit 40 4400 hertz or 26 bit 4800 hertz so set this up and go for ok and try launching the game if that is not the case we can also try one more step that is all about we have to turn off the spatial sound so just do from here itself click on the sound go to the sound sorry we have to go over here not this sound we have to do this we just need to right click sorry we have to click on this one and select the speaker right click and we have to go to the properties go to the spatial sound make sure this is turn it off once you turn this off just uh, close everything close this and we have to go back and try launching the game next one is all about nothing but what we need to do is we just need to disable the oculus so just go over here in the search and we have to go over here in the control panel now from here go to hardware and sound go for sound over here set the speakers and right click and we have to go to the properties now from here make sure apart from this if you find the oculus here just disable it which is also very important disable the oculus once afterwards just close this and we have to go back try launch the game next one is all about nothing but we have to update the driver so just go over here in the game uh, start right click and we have to go to the device manager 
now from here we have to go over here in the sound video and game controllers now uh, realtek rod is the driver select this one go for update driver search automatically for drivers and update the driver so once afterwards we just need to close this we just need to go back and try launch the game next one is all about the last and the least one is all about we have to verify integrity of game file so just go over here right click and we have to go to the properties go for installed file and just click on the verify integrity of game file so this is going to take a little bit of time so what happens is this will cross check every single files of a game which is a very important one or else you'll be having the trouble so just cross check everything and once afterwards you can try launching the game so uh, we need to wait this to reach uh, you know uh, 100 percent so after this i'll be showing you the next one So as you can see the 784 files are successfully validated and once afterwards try launch the game and these are the possible workaround which can be done when you are having an issue with audio or sound is not working on payday 3. I hope this video is helpful. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.